Hi, this is Mike from Radio.co and welcome to Question of the Week. This week's question comes from John Evington of Neocast and John asks, how can I create a live video stream for my radio station? Now, I think this is a fantastic question because it really allows you to give your listeners a window inside your studio. So, you know, they get an idea of what goes on behind the scenes on a day-to-day basis, which in turn allows you to create a much deeper, stronger bond with your listeners. So, for this week's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a live video stream for your radio station and get it straight onto your website. Start your station So there's numerous platforms out there that you can use, from paid services like Livestream and Ustream, to free services like Blab or Google Hangouts. So for the purposes of our tutorial, I'm going to use Google Hangouts. Personally, I think it's the best solution because firstly, it's incredibly easy to use, and best of all, it's totally free. Plus, it automatically posts all of your videos to YouTube once you've finished, which is in itself a big time saver. All you need to get started is a webcam and a laptop or PC with a good internet connection. So the first step is to head to www.plus.google.com forward slash hangouts forward slash on air. Once you've done this, click the create a hangout on air button. The next step is to choose your start time. You can choose to broadcast straight away or at a later date. Now, I would personally recommend choosing broadcast later and then set in the time and date of the live broadcast that you want to video stream. You can also set the duration, obviously. And then once we've done this, we just need to select our audience. Um, now, I'm going to leave it set as public, although there are a few different options that you can, you can select here. Um, but this just means that anyone can access the video. And then finally, we just need to click share, which redirects us to our Hangouts events page. Then, once we've done this, we just need to click start, which launches the Hangouts control window. And for the moment, you can click skip and ignore the invite guests dialog box. And hey presto, you'll be able to see yourself. Next, we want to click the links button, which is in the bottom right hand corner, and we want to copy the video embed link. Then we're going to navigate to our website. So for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm going to use one of our in-house stations, which is called Chilled.io. And it's an eclectic mix of chill out and sparkling lounge vibes if you want to go and check it out. So Chilled.io uses our website builder, which makes it really easy to build and manage your station website. So if you don't have a website and you're interested in setting one up, then I really would recommend checking it out. Um, you can head to radio.co forward slash product or forward slash website um, to get all the information you need. Or alternatively, you can simply drop an email to studio at radio.co with any questions that you have and one of the team will get straight back to you. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how incredibly easy it is to get the video into your site. So you'll notice here that I've created a page called videos and that's where all of our videos are going to live. And all I'm going to do is then drag and drop this HTML block onto this section. And then in this block, I'm going to add the embed code that we copied earlier on. So then when we click out of it, we can see what the embedded video looks like. Now, if you do actually, you might notice that the video looks a little small. So if you want to change the dimensions, that's, it's actually really easy to do. You just need to click back into the HTML and you can see the width and length there and you just need to edit those two numbers if you want to change the shape of it. Now, um, as it was, this is just a tutorial, I'm just going to leave it set as it currently is. So once we're ready to go live, we just need to navigate back to the Hangout Control Center and click the Start Broadcast button on Google Hangouts and your listeners can now get a glimpse inside your studio. So there we have it, that's this week's question. Now, if you have a question and you'd like to submit it for a future edition of Question of the Week, then you can tweet us at radio.co 
or alternatively, you can email us directly at studio at radio.co and we'll add your question to the list of videos and tutorials that we're making.